Hello friend, in this video lecture I am going to discuss about how to get file path and the name in text box using windows application. So here this is the form. So here we need to drag go or text box. So let's go to tool tab and here toolbox you need to write here text. So first uh, let's write text box and uh, drag this text box. Now here this is a uh, multi line here you can see so this is uh, false by default you need to check that true and after making true you can make that bigger of this text box. Now here after I need one button control so when user click on the button then file name or path should be displayed in this text box and here give a meaningful text name of this button so writing here click me now let's uh, make that bigger and uh, here after the next is double click on this uh, or button control and uh, here inside you need to write this code so let's uh, paste here I used to uh, open file dialog so when you take the cursor here you can get display the standard dialog box that prompt the user here this is a class and v1 is the object created by new open dialog constructor so this will do the fair thing so first uh, it can accept uh, if you give a star dot star so it will accept all kind of files text files and here or uh, v1 dot so dialog so dialog dot dialog result when that ok then this condition is to that come inside file name that display into the text box and uh, here let's make that comment now here after so dialog math is the method so it run a comment dialog box with the result so here return dialog result ok if the user click on ok otherwise it go to the else now when that done click on this uh, start button now you can see here there is nothing inside this text box if I click now you can uh, select uh, any files so let's go on this so uh, desktop and here you can by its come text files if you want you can select all the files so here this is the XML file click on open so here it's uh, only displaying the path okay path with the file name now I want to display file name and the path also okay so here let's uh, go to this code and uh, when I make at this place or text box one dot text now here after equal now if I use v1 dot so here I am going to use the file path ok so this is the file name and uh, here let's uh, copy this and paste it there and uh, here you can see I am getting some kind of error message so potential fixes and you need to use uh, this IO namespace now there is no any error now let's uh, run this now here when I click uh, this button and uh, select the, this time I'm going to select the test file and here you can see uh, the same output it's coming there so I want to display this file name so we need to use the separate uh, text box 
okay so this is the text box and here let's go to designer at this place so uh, going to use so uh, you can use this text box or if you want then you can use the text box now here after let's go to coding part and uh, here this is not required and uh, so file name and path in the separate text box so here let's use this here you can see this not text so it's uh, display into the rich text box and here this path is display into the or uh, text box okay so by using this we can easily display separate file and text box now there is one important thing let's go at this place here going to delete and here let's uh, take this one more text box and uh, here you cannot make that bigger we need to make that multi line to true after that we can make that bigger so this is the text box 2 you can see the name text box 2 now go to the form and uh, here in place of rich text box let's give text box 2 now use this dot and uh, let's run this code so this is the text box 1 text box 2 click on the button here let's uh, use so here you can see in our text box one this is the file path and file name and displaying in the next text box so here this is the way so file first uh, whatever the things that uh, display or the path and uh, next to uh, that display the file name get file name so here v1 dot file name so path is the class that uh, with the help of path class you can call get file name and uh, it will take the file name and display into the text box too so this place you can use the uh, rich text box or text box anyone from this too so this is the way we can here get the file name and path in text box using windows application so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video thank you